Hello YouTube! Tomorrow is the year 2013 and uh, all I can say is 13 is a lucky number and I'm not so sure what's going to happen. But I can tell you what a great year this has been for me. I don't know about you, you can leave your comments down below and tell me what you, how you felt about the year 2012. I'm just giving you my favourite parts. The Olympics, I'm just going to say, I didn't watch, but I know was amazing because my mum wouldn't stop going on about it. And I did see some, I did see the opening and the closing, and I, I did like it. I wish I could have caught up on it. I think there's a DVD coming out, which the BBC are producing. But for now, I haven't actually watched the whole thing, and I'm probably not going to get to watching the whole thing. But anyways, um, I'm here to uh, list the things which have been amazing. So, this in no particular order, I'm going to go straight into Titanic. Now, now, as most of you know, I'm a massive Titanorak, as my mum calls me, which means fanatic about Titanic. Um, so I'm a Titanic rat, Titanic Titanorak, and um, back in, I think it was around May, summertime, we saw an ad in the newspaper and it was for an audition for a little musical called Titanic the Musical. And they were looking and they were auditioning on the Saturday that we saw this newspaper. And fortunately, there was a role for a 14, 15 year old boy. At the time it was 30, but it didn't really matter. Uh, so I keep looking over there because that's where I am. The iPad's filming there. We'll get back to that in a second. Um, and I auditioned for a bellboy. And this is with the Chaos. This is with Chaos. Um, and they are amazing. I, I we'll come back to them in a sec. Um, but yeah, Titanic the musical. We got in, and it's kind of like a first experience because usually I've done productions in school, and I'll come to that again later. Um, and this is my first outside performance with other people I don't know. And uh, I met loads of people. There was the director, the music director. Ton there was a huge cast. It was like. 30 odd people, more, probably more than that, playing loads. And six, apparently, I heard today, £60,000 went into it, which I'm quite surprised about. Um, also, that was, and when it came to the week, which was at the end of September, so after that, it was the last performance was on the Saturday, and then on Sunday, I turned 14, so yeah, I'm gonna get back to that. Um, and yeah, that was absolutely amazing, I can't believe it. And the after show party, yes, yeah, so we will come back to that later. Um, Chaos. Now, at the moment, I am in a... I'm in Annie. Um, I'm also in Annie. I'm, I'm not playing Annie. I'd love to. <laughs> I mean, everyone wants to play Annie. Um, it's a hard nap life. My sister auditioned for one of the, um, the orphans, but she didn't get a part. She's really sad, because I was given a part over it via email, uh, from the, um, from a, uh, what, the, uh, kind of, like, supporter or whatever. Uh, I can't go, I can't say names, I don't think that's fair. Um, and Elsie was really sad. But um, she's kind of improved because while we're doing any at the moment, which is going to be in February, um, the young gen, young generation, which is basically like Kale's only for the children, so it comes down to me because with Kale's it's all the adults. So young generation is with children at our age and younger. And uh, one of there was a boy there who was in Titanic, and um, yeah, I know him. And there's some other kids from my school, and yeah, we get I get along very well. There's a lot of girls down there. No idea how this is going to turn out. Uh, they'll probably watch this and think, who knows? Um, but yeah, Elsie got into that, and so did I. And it, I don't think I've actually told you yet, it is The Lion, The Witch and The Wardrobe. I'm not going to sing it now because it spoils everything. And Elsie got a part as a WRVS woman. But, oh, by the way, Nanny, I'm just an extra. I don't, I'm not given a specific part. And, um, with, and I play Margrim. Margrim, the Eve, if you don't know who Margrim is, um, because you can only remember who the characters were not their names, then I am the evil wolf that gets slayed by Peter about halfway through, the, no not even that, halfway through the second act. And uh, yes, uh, because it's with, you know, children, we have to um, do double cast, so there's another, someone else 
is playing uh, Margrim as well. And uh, that should be interesting. Okay, um, Lego Guys on YouTube. Well, when I announced that, no one liked it. And I don't like that. But I'm excited about it. That's all that matters, hopefully. Even though I would like more people to be interested in it. Because you, it is interesting. Um, guys and Dolls. Uh, this is a school production. Which I said I'd come back to. Uh, guys and Dolls. It really support. I did it and I got so much more support at school. I really want to thank you guys so much for the support you've been giving me. Uh, Minecraft. Minecraft is just amazing. Got it this year. It is amazing. I love it. If you haven't seen or played Minecraft, then I suggest you go watch it because it's a very interesting game, especially for those who like creativity, use their imagination. It's like basically kind of like a different version of Lego, only a cyber world, multiplayer and all that. And it is really good and there's mods and this is where, this is where I found out things about like Yogg's Cars, Captain Sparkles, The Syndicate Project, yada yada, Shadow Visual. And I got all that in the year 2012, which is good. Um, the iPad, I'm filming on this. This is what I got as a birthday present after I did the Titanic the Musical performance. And, uh, oh boy, that was just amazing. Uh, I got this iPad and I've been using it ever since, and it is an amazing device. Now, please stop shitstorming on about, like, Oh, next is Google further because it's cheaper. Look, I understand. You might prefer it because it's cheaper. But I bought this because I like Apple products and I was able to afford it. Okay? It, it's not a big deal. Okay? Just shut up about it. You've got a Nexus. Well, great. Amazing for you. You've got you've got a Nexus. You've got a device which is touchscreen and portable. So have I. You haven't got a shitstorm about on about it. And now there's some people. Anyways, yes. As of the iPad, I got it on my birthday. I'm 14 now. I probably, now most of my friends are going to be saying, you haven't changed a bit since year six, which is when I was, I can't remember the age now, that's how stupid I am. But uh, yes, I'm 14 now, which I've already said in the other video, that was a, that was a good thing, it was kind of, it felt strange to be older because I'm starting to feel like a teenager now and I'm growing up. Um, Wales, I went to Wales a third time this year with my friend Mikey. Um, and his parents, and that was amazing, because the first time I went, four years ago in 2008, I got video footage of it, and it's backed up somewhere, and I haven't seen it since, and it was backed up like three years ago. Um, last time I went 2011 last year, and that was good, I got some footage of that on here, uh, quite a lot actually, and this year, I forgot to bring my battery charger, so I got one piece of footage at the beginning of me talking, and it was terrible. Uh, anyways, yeah, but yeah, this one was amazing. I loved it because we went up the we went up Snowdonia, which I saw on the news when they were lighting the uh, torches. Um, Christmas, that was amazing. That was only six days ago, and that was absolutely amazing. I loved it. And looking at the time, I'd say it's nearly time for New Year. I'm not actually filming this. It's now half past seven. Uh, so that's going to be another five, four and a half so hours or something. Four and a half hours. Uh, what else have we got? Oh yes, uh, the Model Club. Now, not many people are going to know about this clearly, but me and my friend Zubair have a, um, quite a bad, when we start, when I started my uh, secondary school, uh, I think you Americans call it middle school, even though I call it high school, and then we say college and university, I don't know what the hell you call that. I think I worked it out, middle school, to you Americans, middle school, to me, high school, and all other Brits. Uh, anyways, yes, uh, when I started, we, uh, uh, me and my mum came up with an idea for a model club, and this is kind of like Hornby Airfix and Skeletrix. And now, it has become a huge success, unfortunately it's only with Hornby, there is no uh, Skeletrix at all. Airfix, there's a plane or two, but that's really it. And, uh, yeah, but the whole Hornby song, we're making this great layout, and we want to get it into an exhibition of ours. Now, um, the Model Railway Exhibition at Kegs, that is where we're taking it, uh, hopefully, if we can get it finished, and we've got, like, a team of, like, 30 kids working on it, and it's really interesting. Um, yes, of course, this year I reached 100 to 150 subscribers, so I reached 100 subscribers 
five months ago, and uh, ever so recently, I've reached 150 subscribers, which I'm really glad about. So in that five months, I've re I've got 10 subscribers a month, and for the past three years, I've gained 100 subscribers. So I'm kind of glad about that. So that I'm kind of I'm really glad about that. I'm really glad that I've made the 100 150 mark. Also, I reached 500,000 video views, half a million view video views, and now I'm on 600,000 video views. And that is just an amazing thing. I'm so glad. It's kind of strange because I've got all these video views, but very few subscribers when you kind of compare the two. Um, also, I've got to point this out. I had to save this for last. I've gained, I've gotten to know millions of people. Guys and Dolls, Chaos, Young Gen, you name it. Oh my god. I've met so many people this year, and I'm really glad. And I really want to thank them for being there to support me, and I... Hopefully I'm supportive as well. I don't want to just be that guy in the duffel coat. And yes, I come to the end of my video where I say goodbye, folks. See you next year.